In 2011, the British charity and Malagashi NGO as a far implemented community lead total sanitation. CRTS in Beandi, a village in southeast Madagascar. After 14 months, the village became the first in Matalaki rural commune to be verified as 100% open defecation free ODF. The community soon noticed that their health improved and with people now using that tree, the coffee and fruit trees became free from defecation for the first time, leading to increase the harvest across the 600s. After a cyclone in early 2013, combined with the effect of the Malagashi climate, many of the latrines started to fall into disrepair. And by mid 2013, latrine use had fallen. It was now estimated that only 50% of people in Bianji were consistently using latrines. Azafadi began working with the respected elders and community leaders in Bianji to retrigger CRTS. The community leaders were determined to get the rest of the hamlets using latrine again not just for a few months, but forever. Changing people's behavior would not be an easy task. So Azafat began looking for a way to empower the leaders with new skills. They needed an approach that would bring the whole community together. In November 2013, an Azofadi staff member trained in participatory video ran a 10-day workshop with three male and three female community leaders, each respecting one of six hamlets of Bianji. <laughs> Gamani exercises were used to teach basic camera skills, and soon the community leaders began exploring different ways of using video to make an impact. As their confidence grew, they started to use interviews, role play, and direct statements. You mean the sea? Ramana Shatanga. Tangana, 
Yun sila pala yun, agagdig na rin kuruhan ni Rantay lahat na makafi ang hukab lahat na tananang. Uts ka rin namas ka niyo, fab, yung lahat na dyan sa azoy, yung patos ka kafi, ato rin yung pelo kafi, michuks ka lahat na isang. Ay, kor mo fa. Ano rin ko sa mo, fuknul nab? Hindi ka fuknul nito, biyan, di mikash kong FTTF. Fam, ba yalaw si ka umangere mga kalaman sana yu, fa yu umaparar yu. The community will involve as much as possible to help the filmmakers reflect on the state of sanitation in Bianchi. <laughs> With the community's help, the participants voted to decide on what they thought were the most important health and sanitation issues across the six hamlets. They created a storyboard to organize the ideas. This became their map while they were filming. During the next four days, some 95 people, from young children to grandparents, were interviewed or appeared on film, with sanitation and hygiene as the central topic. I'm <laughs> By moving from hamlet to hamlet and watching the footage after each take, the novelty of Angie's first video production crew always drew a large crowd of spectators. Spectators quickly became participants themselves, offering their feedback and generating debate. The footage was also replayed in the evening, attracting large and excited audiences. Once the filming was completed, the participant drew out each shot onto separate post-it notes. The different shots were compared with each other until a decision was made on which was the best one to represent the scene. These were then transferred onto a paper timeline. Once the paper editing was complete, the participants directed the computer editing by bringing the different posted notes from the paper timeline to the facilitator. The facilitator found each clip, pulled them into the editing software and waited for further instruction from the participants. As rough cuts of the film came together, 
feedback was sought from the community and a few extra shirts were collected to fill any gaps. The participants invited everyone to come to a community screening at the local school. The film screened for two nights in a row. The participant, Michelle, was able to reach audience of over 200 people on each night. With all the hamlets represented in the audience, this was a unique opportunity to engage the whole community. Everyone was very happy to see themselves and their village on the big screen and thought the film was a great success. The participants want their film to be watched by as many people as possible. They will be distributing the film on DVD throughout PNG and to other communities in the area. Copies of the film will also be distributed to local Polish cinema. The mayor of Matalaki Rural Commune and to anyone locally that owns a generator or TV. Follow-up visits, community meetings and workshop on lettering design will be facilitated by the third over the coming months to try and motivate the communities to return to 100 poaching open defecation free status. The film will provide the community leaders in BRG and elsewhere with a new tool to educate on the importance of sanitation in a region where 10% of all deaths of children under 5 years is attributed to diarrhea. To find out more, please visit www.madagascar.co.uk. Nadella Vitabe Azo Nella Nella Nella